Hey guys, it's Benny here. Today, I'm going to be doing a 100 subscriber Q&A because I hit 100 subscribers about last week. So, let's just get into this. All these questions are from Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. That's literally the only things I ask for questions on. So, the first question, do you like potatoes? Now, it depends. Is the potato fried? Is it roasted? Is it baked? Is it mashed? Is it scalloped? Is it raw? Is it green? It really depends. So, I hope that answered your question. So, let's go on to the next question. Just to see if we have any more, like, little bits of humanity in it. And, truth behold, it does have bits of humanity in it. So, most embarrassing moments in gaming. Now, there are plenty. But most of them are on my friend Paul's channel. His channel name is Epic Barbecue. I'd recommend go subscribing to him. Check out his Twitch channel as well. But one embarrassing moment. <laughs> oh, boy. We were playing Friday the 13th. And since... I'm not all that great at Friday the 13th, the game. I drove the car. <laughs> and when I was driving the car, I was, like, driving backwards out of the map. I didn't know my way around it because it just came out, like, like, a few days before it. And I never drove on it or anything. I didn't know any of the exits. So when I drove the car, I almost ran to a wall. So I went to drive forward. I ran right into a wall and Jason at the same time. So I ended up escaping from Jason, but Paul, he got grabbed and died. <laughs> okay, that's a very embarrassing moment in gaming. Starting my channel. Since my channel is a gaming channel, it is pretty embarrassing because I started it when I was 10. And my first video was Roblox. Yeah. That's not something you want to hear every day. So, hope that answers your question. Let's get on to the third question. When is Nintendogs? Nintendogs was a game that was released April 21st, 2005 by Touch Generations. Oh, I know it was released in that series. But it came, but it came out on the Nintendo DS in 2005. Think you're about, like, 12 years behind. So I hope that answers your question. So let's get on to the next one. What content do I plan on making besides gaming in the future? Now, content I plan on doing besides gaming is I want to bring Vlogmas back this year. I didn't do it last year because I was a lazy little scrub. <laughs> so this year, hopefully there's going to be a Vlogmas. And... <laughs> I'm probably going to do vlogs in between. I suck at singings. I'm going to bring that back because I haven't done one in forever. Since my northern downpour, I suck at singing. Maybe if you have set up tours, unboxings, collab videos. It's really all I could think of. Maybe building a computer? <laughs> Possibly. I don't know, but I hope that answers your question besides what I want to do, besides gaming in the future. But that's just what I want to do. That's not what I plan on doing. So, next question. Will you subscribe to CB Gaming? Now, here's a question I have a very specific answer for. So, let's get into a video clip. Okay, so first off, you gotta go into Google Chrome. Wait for it to load up. Get YouTube open. Sorry, Shane, I'll watch that later. Um, oh, 0 0.25 A presses. Okay. Search. Okay. The Minecraft guy. You have to search the Minecraft guy to find CV Gaming, the one that wants me to subscribe to him. Okay. So, not sure 
if I should subscribe to him or not. So, you know what, screw it, let's search it. It's, uh, this is fun. Be watching that later, be watching that later. Maybe that later. Not because it's always bo booty, it's because Clint Stevens. Okay, why won't the Minecraft guy search? Quality content. Benny Plays is my name, quality content is my game. Spelled the wrong. <laughs> it's wrote uh, the Minecraft guy. And no, this is not the recording that's lagging. It's my computer. Just how bad my computer is. Oh, I'm already subscribed. Well, I guess I know what I have to do. I'm not subscribing to you. Hope you enjoyed that small little thing that I just did. <laughs> I'm subscribing from the Minecraft guy. I'm probably not going to subscribe again. Um, so the next question. How big of a Panic at the Disco fan are you? So I am a fan of Panic at the Disco. They are my second favorite band. 21 Pilots is my first, then Panic at the Disco, then My Chemical Romance, and Fall Out Boy. Then Green Day. I'm a major emo. <laughs> so I am a really big fan of Panic, but I do like 21 Pilots more. My Chemical Romance doesn't stray far from Panic, and Panic isn't all that far from 21 Pilots either, but 21 Pilots just holds a place in me that it can't just be taken out of number one. So I hope that answers your question. Let's get to the next one. The next question is, how did you meet all of your friends? Now, most of my friends I met in real life, um, I'm gonna name the people that I play in videos with and everything, like, from time to time, commonly. I met Six Platypus, or Ethan as I call him, like, in third grade. He was someone in my class. So, I met him that through school. Silver Screen, or Jaden as I call him, because that's his name. He, I met him in fifth grade through my friend, who I don't know if she wants me to say her name, so I won't. But I met him in fifth grade, and we've been friends ever since, so we just play a ton of horror games and Overwatch and Rainbow Six Siege. So, gal friend, I met her through my friend Paul, who I met from... I'm gonna say how I met Paul, then I'm gonna say how I met gal friend. Um, I met Paul because, like, I, w I just got Friday the 13th that game, so I went on, I mean, not that game, that day, <laughs> sorry, but I got Friday the 13th the day I met him, so I went on YouTube and I searched Friday the 13th PS4 Live. I found this YouTuber named Epic Barbecue, <laughs> or BBQ, however you like to say it or pronounce it, so I went on to... YouTube, and after I found his channel, I asked him if I could join in. To my surprise, he said yes, and I joined him, and I met a ton of other people, Gray Lee, Sammy P for Real, Sean Draven, like, Cam Newton, like, there's a bunch of people that I otherwise wouldn't have met. I met Gal Friend through him, who I talk to this day, I play Rainbow, play horror games, <laughs> GTA with. So, 
like, I don't think there's really much other friends that I commonly play with from time to time. Like, there's Archonet Games, who I used to play with. I had, like, few videos up with him. He's my cousin, so... Kind of how I met him at a party when I was 10, when I first started YouTube. So, hope that answers your question. Yeah, that went on way longer than I thought it would have. <laughs> so, let's get on to maybe the final question, unless I get more. If I get more questions, then I'll end up answering those in the video. But if not, then this will be the last question. What is the first console you ever received? So I'm going to name handheld console and actual console. I'm going to name the first console I played, the first handheld console I received myself, and the first handheld, I mean, and the first actual console that I got. Like, I, the first console that I played ever was the PlayStation 2. It, I loved it at the time, and I still love it to this day. I play games like Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, Vice City, Crash Bandicoot, like Tony Hawk games, Guitar Hero games. Man, like, the amount of nostalgia I get when I play the PlayStation 2. Buzz Robo Jam, I believe it's called. That game was fun. I used to really enjoy it. But the first console I ever played was a PlayStation 2. Now, the first handheld console I received was a white Nintendo DS with Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. My mom gave it to my dad for his birthday one year, and he ended up giving it to me because he didn't really want it. I believe, I believe that's how I remember it. I don't know, I was three. So, I played that thing a lot. Like, I had it up until I was in fourth grade when I snapped the top right off of it because like the screen didn't work from me biting it when I was little so like I had to get in a certain position when I tried to position it it snapped but I do have a Nintendo 3DS now so I can still play the DS games which I'm really glad about <laughs> but the first handheld I had was a Nintendo DS it was a DS Lite too not like a normal DS and the first console I ever received, not played, was a Nintendo Wii, which I still play to this day. Those things are strong. Like, it has so many battle scars on it. Now, I received it for Christmas one year when I was really little. I was like six years old. About seven years ago, because I'm 13 now, so. I'm 13 and in seventh grade, so. But with that, like, I played so many games on that Wii. I played Skyward, Skyward Sword, which I still play. Mario 64, which I downloaded off the Virtual Console. I play it now. I do have an emulator, but it's so much better on the Wii because there's so much more ways you can exploit it. But the thing is, well, on the emulator, it is like the original N64 emulator that you're playing. But on the Wii, like, it is still, like, a built-in emulator. So, but I would rather the emulator, actually, over the Wii, but it doesn't matter. So, <laughs> I really enjoyed the Wii. I have played so much games on it. I'm currently speedrunning Mario 64, trying to do 16 star speedruns. If I had a good enough computer, I would live stream it, but I can't. Because I have a bad computer. But, <laughs> I really enjoy the three consoles. PlayStation 2, the Wii, the DS. Is... After the Wii, I got a PlayStation 3, which I played all the time. I met multiple friends on there who I very, very rarely ever talk to. After that, I got an Xbox 360, which I love. Like, I still play Black Ops 2 and Minecraft on it. Um, then after that, I got my PlayStation 4. That was my next console. I'm not going to consider a computer a console. So, I love the PlayStation 4. It is my favorite console that I own. I play it each and every day. The Nintendo Switch. I love the Switch. It's so innovative. It's amazing. It has great games on it. 
people say it sucks, but I really love it. Like, I only have three games, and I still play it a lot, and I really love the Switch. So I hope that answers your question. I'm taking a while on these questions, but all these questions were really good besides, like, the first, like, two. <laughs> the win is Nintendogs, and... Do you like potatoes? Those were like the only two like joke questions that I had. So I really hope you enjoyed the video. I'm going to end it here. Hope you enjoy the rest of the Fortnite gameplay if it didn't already end. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.